Hello YouTube fans. I'll give a two thumbs up. Finally got my shipment. I ordered it from New Egg on a uh, promo they had on a brand new phone which I'm primarily going to use the great camera that it has. I'm going to use it for filming videos, my RC videos. Here's the unboxing of the Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge. This is the Duos version which is an international version running the Exynos octa-core processor. Super excited about this phone. It's got some top-end specs for 2016. One of the best phones out there right now. So it runs 4G LTE. It's got 4 gigabytes of RAM. And this is the dual SIM version, which is the international one. You can run two separate SIMs. One SIM one can be ran on 4G LTE, while the second SIM is probably going to be, I believe, running on 2G. So, great for going on trips. So, be careful if you're using some sharp, sharp objects to cut off some tape. As always, safety first. Dun, 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 dun. Here we go, folks. It's the new Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge. Such an awesome phone, super sleek. Look at how thin this is. Prior to this phone, I've been using the OnePlus 2, which has been a great phone. Both 5.5 inch. Even though both phones are 5.5 inch, this new, because of the edge screen on the Samsung Galaxy, it's physically smaller in size than the OnePlus 2 uh, because the edges bend and uh, fold down over the edges and because of that also it physically is easier to hold especially for using one-handed operation this is about the limit on this phone it does feel better in the hand with the better edges on this compared to the S6 edge um, so great changes by Samsung here so inside here is like a quick quick guide on top here on top of the phone We've got the SIM tray on the left side are the volume buttons. Right side we've got the power buttons. And then the physical home button is the best button you can press. And it also acts as the fingerprint sensor. And on the left and right of that are the nav buttons. So super, super excited to get this phone going. I'm going to eventually probably root this phone. But for now, I'm going to try to run it as stock. So it comes with this pamphlet, which um, I thought I was kind of super excited on the left side of that pamphlet. The concierge is talking about uh, an additional warranty you can get, um, which covers damage and um, up to even a replacement if they cannot fix. Um, but when I started going online, it looks like it wouldn't work if you're in the United States. So kind of bummed about that. But going on accessories that it comes with since it's the international version it came with a um, glad that it came with the US adapter the power charger that it comes with have the two round prongs which is typically not used in the United States but it comes with a little black piece which adapts for the US plugs so super awesome this charger is also capable of doing quick charge um, so it'll charge your phone a little faster I've not been using that. I'm not too keen on using fast charging batteries because, uh, I, I don't know, I think that personally might shorten the life of batteries. Over there, it comes with the OTG cable, on-the-go cable, so you can attach different accessories to your phone. And also attaching uh, external devices, SD cards to transfer. And in this small case, we've got nice headphones, pretty decent ones from what I hear. And I've seen on these Samsung ones. I've uh, I've used several Samsung Galaxies over the years. I've had the very first Galaxy that's come out, Galaxy S. Actually, I've had Galaxy S, Galaxy S2, 3, and 4. I skipped the 5, which I really wanted because of the waterproof, um, but the timing just never came around to being in the right place. Anyway, here's the Samsung with the screen on. Um, I'll have more updates regarding the progress of this phone and how I'm going to be using it. Um, as always, thanks for watching, and please subscribe, like, share, and comment. Um, thanks again for watching. 
I'll keep you updated. We're gonna, there's going to be some exciting changes for this phone and also some filming for the RCs. Thank you.